I just cleaned out Casper and Odie's houses and I put in some new substrate. Um, so it's a lot thicker this time. Um, and I also am gradually working on getting it to be kind of bioactive. So here's Casper. He's got a little bit of shed he's still working on, but hopefully this new um, substrate will help him with that. I'm going a different route on um, what I'm using. So it's organic um, and I made it kind of a blend. Um, but anyway, so he's got all rearranged house. Um, here's one of his rocks and his hide. Um, this is a fake plant over here, but, um, <clears throat> and then all some of his crystals and treasures, but these are live, uh, ivy plants. There's his Empire State Building, and that's another live ivy. So I don't have any of the like uh, beetles and stuff like that yet, but Casper's just checking it out, sniffing all the new smells. Hey, Casper. Um, and then, so yeah, there's Casper's house. And then Odie, similar, the same process basically. He's got an antler in here to climb. Found that in Cooper Landing. He's got a big crystal here and to exfoliate. And then he's got his new ivies over here and over in this corner. And then he's got his little uh, Japanese, uh, I think that's what it is, Japanese float, floaty ball thing. And his snarly stick to climb and exfoliate. And he needs a new hide. This is too small for him, so he doesn't usually lay under it much anymore. But right now... That's all we've got. So we're going to eventually upgrade that for him. Hey, Odie. And, yeah. Um, Odie's house used to be probably, like, the least, had, like, the least amount of substrate in it. So I tried to spoil him a little bit and give him a nice thick layer. Um... His big water dish. Hi, baby. Hello. So, yeah. And then I've also got some rats thawing out for them. They both are in the end of their shed. And so they're hungry. So here in a few hours, they're going to each have some rats.